Hey guys, welcome back, Orbomb here, bringing another episode of our Pokemon Showdown live with our boy Ioku. Oh, fuck. So, like, <laughs> my fan's on. Hold on. I'm here, though. I'm here. But I'm going to turn my fan off so you don't uh, have that in the back. Uh, that's a good idea. Um, this is another episode of uh, Training Ioku. I haven't figured out a name for it yet. But uh, I'm going to go over the team this time. <clears throat> Did I go over the team last time? I don't think I went over the team last time. I'm going to go over the team this time. Mainly for Blizzard's sake, because this is the team that I used in the Wi-Fi battle against him yesterday. You there, buddy? I am here now. Alright, cool. We got Shift Gear Magirna with Ori Sphere, Flash Cannon, Flare Cannon. Flare Cannon is absolutely destructive. Um, Defog Tapu Fini, just for support. Choice Banded, Bus Swole, because it's busted. Uh, D-Dance Flygon with uh, Life Orb. Fire Blast for the Bulus. Uh, we got my favorite, Normally MZ. <laughs> If you guys don't know what this does, apparently whenever you use uh, Z conversion, it turns you into a ghost type and ups all your stats by one. And then you have download, so maybe you get that plus two special attack, start blowing everybody away with a stab shadow ball, because nothing really resists that. And then we got Mimikyu, just kind of there for will o -Wisp, just to deal with specific Pokemon. It was it was there for Zygarde, um, but Zygarde is no longer around, so I guess we can now Wisp physical Pheromosas and Shadow Sneak them. At least that's the goal. And that's the team. You got that, Blizz? You wrote that down yes. in your imaginary notebook? Yes, sir. I, right. ha I have that ready, sir. Yes, sir. Good good job. He's my student, guys. Um, Here it is, Magirna. All right, let's get this. You kind of cop this first game? Yes, please. I would like to cop the first game, sir. Oh, God, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> it's all you. Oh, God, it's doing the thing. Um, hold on, guys. I think I have to do this. Zoom. All right, it's a little bit smaller, guys, but I think you guys can live. Um, all right. Okay. So, so this, this man has like his in-game team plus uh, plus Tapu Lele. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty wild. Could you, man. Could you stop wild. this? <laughs> could this you, stop? What do you mean? Could you stop? Stop this nonsense. Uh, well, do I have some rocks? No, Looks like I don't rocks. have any rocks, so that's gonna be a problem. Um, thankfully I have some rock removal, so that's nice with Tapu Fini there, guys. I mean, you like, know, if you that. lead Buswall, I think you just get a kill, unless he leads with Tapu Lele, and if that's the case, you have We're gonna lead with Buswall. Yes, yeah, Oh, Lele. yeah. That's bad, We're actually. fucked. <laughs> I forgot yeah. this thing. So we have Tapu Fini, kind of. Um, oh, no, no. We actually don't, don't have do a switch into this. <laughs> you, you don't want to do that. Uh, we, we do. We I figured out that Ground Dragon is a hard stop to Salazzle. It's not really a hard stop, but it's like a check. Because ground resists poison and mm, dragon resists fire. I don't think he'll go for dragon pulse here, but we do, we don't outspeed. That's the thing. So if he goes for dragon pulse the following turn, then we're kind of screwed. Why why don't you outspeed him? Oh yeah, because you're cause like base Lazzle's 100. base one fifteen. <laughs> it's very isn't it faster? Uh, just go into top of Fini. We don't even need it this game. So who cares about fail if it faints? Seriously? Yeah, we don't need it. Like we really don't. I got this. I'm gonna go on the fly guy. All right. He's not gonna deep pulse me, man. Look at that, and he missed. Yeah, but the that. thing is, like, he's faster than you. Yeah. So unless so you want to double now the we're gonna check if he has deep pulse, which you know he didn't, didn't. work out for us um, at all. He no. kind of predicted you. <laughs> no. Oh, you yeah. don't have ice beam. Okay, that's. No. Does that's, this thing get ice beam? Yeah, it gets ice beam. Oh. Cool. Feeny gets ice beam. Um, um, I mean, just Magirna kind of walls us. Plus, we can hit Flare Cannon, which is like, oh, oh. look at that. You know what we do? Oh. We outspeed and we hit it with a flare cannon. <laughs> and just body bag this thing. <laughs> do we outspeed? I think we outspeed. Oh, we don't outspeed. Oh, crap. God that did damn. way too much. Anyways, get bodied. Gone. Oof. Gone. We're going to die, though. That's fine. We can outspeed the uh, a couple of his Pokemon, actually, and get off one more flare cannon later. If he goes into Salazzle, we don't. No, I mean, we can switch out. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know that. I know that. But, like, we, we outspeed... Um, the 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 the, the Primarina. Uh, Primarina, baby. So if we can catch ourselves against Primarina, we can uh, predict that and just do whatever. Plus, it's a nice sack to have for later. Thor Cannon's busted, dude. It's so good. Hello, this thing is back. Do you want to predict it to go for like a an attack that requires it to set up? <laughs> It doesn't I have. I mean, it has it has nasty plot, but I really don't think anyone's running nasty. I plot think he Lazzle. specs because he went for fire blast. I would just go back to Feeny, to be honest. Unless yeah, you want to do the flag on play again. 
No, I'm gonna go into. Oh, there's. Oh shit! Someone you. is actually running it. My glove. It's good. He's probably Sash. I actually yeah, killed. damn. Um, I mean, this is why. No, he's life orb. Have... Oh, he's lucky. Okay, hold up. Let's let's think about this then. Everything will kill us. He's probably. Oh, you don't Dragon really source damage. Last attack. Uh, we can go. Oof, man, this thing actually kind of beats us. Let's see. Nasty plot, fire blast, sludge wave. He might have dragon pulse as his last move. He probably does, to be honest. Um, I think we lose. I mean, we don't really have a choice. We can just go into Mimikyu, click. Uh, I mean, click Shadow Sneak twice. That's our only play. Does that kill? It does. I don't think it will kill, but we can at least chip him down from Life Orb. Because uh, I think everything else is resisted. Yeah, everything else is resisted, so we have to go for Shadow Sneak. Because <clears throat> 90 becomes, what, 135, which half of that is... There, there we go, that crit was... Whew, God damn. That crit was necessary. And now he takes Life Orb, and then we finish him off with a Shadow Sneak. Oh, look at the busted... <laughs> 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 Yo! <laughs> <I didn't... laughs> That's hilarious. Busted. Mimikyu coming through. Mimikyu coming through. How much did that shift? Oh, so Shadow Sync did about 40%. So the crit didn't matter in the end. Um, mm -hmm. Which is really nice. I think we have to sweep this guy with Porygon. I think that's our only way to win. Mm. We can. What do you want to do He's going to crunch. He's going to crunch. Ooh. You think so? No. You want a Willow? He might Swords Dance. Yeah. yeah that's there what we I go. Don't miss. There we go. Mimikyu. Mimikyu Beautiful. is the best. Nobody can stop Mimikyu. Beautiful. So now you want to leech life? Uh, does, oh, ooh, get that health back. Mm, delicious, tasty. There we go. <sighs> we does the skies work if we hit 100 again? No, we don't. It doesn't come back. It's only once. Oh, so it's just once? Okay. Yeah. Uh, he might go for, yeah, Stone Edge. I was, uh, no, it doesn't matter. Uh, once again, we don't have anything that outspeeds this. But we did yeah, burn he, it. He we have less wool. You sure? Do you have anything for? Oh no, you don't have anything for uh for Marina. That's the issue. What are you talking so about? I'm, I'm not even earthquake, gonna. DD. Earthquake does a lot of damage. To so Primarina? Yeah. Okay. Especially at plus one. But like I said, we're gonna have to win this game with uh, Porygon, so we're gonna have to set up on Primarina. So I say, I whatever. If, if he goes, I should have DD'd again. I didn't even think he was gonna do that. I should have DD'd a fucking gun. Yeah, Earthquake is going to do a shit ton to anything. Yeah, um... Oh man, I really want to set up on this. On Primarina? No, you know what? Switch into Magirna. Sack off, sack off Magirna. Yeah, I want to set up Porygon on this. And now go into Porygon and just click Conversion. We should survive anything because we're getting a plus one boost to everything. Oh, we got the attack boost. That's lame, but it doesn't matter. So Z Conversion. Z Conversion, yeah. Yeah! There you go. Failed. Oh, if, oh, it doesn't turn you into a ghost. Oh, I think it's because you have to go for try attack first. It doesn't matter though. Just click Thunderbolt. We kind of win right now. Oh, I did zero. No, really Things assault fun. vest. That's assault. Oh, whatever. Thunderbolt kills now. But damn. <laughs> Thunderbolt. Uh, Thunderbolt. Also, guys, Primer, apologies you know. for burping right there. I did not. Uh, now we just I click Ice Beam. I don't think this game gets any priority. So. We ice beam knock this out and then we win the shadow ball. Gone. Good job, Porygon. Good job. <laughs> oh my god, job. Porygon. I told you we had to sleep with Porygon. Shadow Ball Good is Good job, boy. Porygon. Good now, job. Now the thing is if we if Flygon can't kill this after a Shadow Ball. Uh or oh yeah, never mind. We're good. <laughs> Are you life orb? Tell me your life orb. Hey, there it is. Good there job. There it is. Okay. Good job. We brought that back. So I like that move set, so I don't think I'm gonna change it. I'll let it. I'll just let it fail, I guess. Um, let me double check what conversion does, though. I thought that somebody told me that's what it did, but I guess that somebody lied to me. Yeah, I thought we saw it, but I didn't see anything. Conversion like changes the user types to match its first move, so we have to go for Shadow Ball first, then click Z conversion. Oh. It was kind of lame, but whatever. Anyways, uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and get another ma match. All right, um, I had to grab something but i am i am back now okay oh look another salazzle everybody's running salazzle now i like crocodile a lot right now zerk tree is here this why do you why do i get the hard games this is ridiculous um <laughs> he has baneful bunker in the back 
Magirna kind of grabs a kill if I was HP fire, which I should be HP fire. I think I'm going to change my Magirna to HP fire. Then again, I don't really die. I have Ori Sphere. What are you doing? I'm recording a video. What do I lead with? I'm typing. There's so many leads he has. I think he might lead with Zerk Tree. And if he's HP Ice, we're kind of screwed. I mean, if Zerk Tree's Scarf, then yeah. I just want, I'm going to leave with Magirna. Do I leave with Magirna? Oh, I'm going to leave with Sabafini. Come on. Oh, I knew he was going to leave with Zerk Tree. Uh, no, I, I told knew it. you. Oh. Man, what am I going to do here? Flag on, I guess. Let's see if he's locked in anything. Yeah, there's Volt Switch. Alright, so I'm just gonna click Earthquake here. I wanna see if he's locked in. All of his Pokemon are grounded. Look, this team is the most Earthquake weak team I've ever seen. No, his team's the most Earthquake weak team I've ever seen. I'm not gonna Dragon Dance until I guarantee a sweep. I'd rather just get damage off for now. That makes sense. Plus, he has Intimidate in the back, so Dragon Dancing would do nothing for me. Alright. <laughs> All of his Pokemon are grounded. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, you better, you better hit him. He has three Earthquake weaknesses. And he went into this out of all Pokemon. Oh my uh, god, is we this thing speed. Scarf? We outspeed. This thing is Scarf, I bet. I doubt it. I don't know if I should risk this. Go on to Tapu Fini then. Go on to Tapu Fini and then go on to McGinner. Just to check and see if he has um, yeah, I'm gonna go Poison Jab. Yeah, he's definitely Scarf. There's no way he did that. He's going to be locked in here. Uh, which means he's going to switch into Toxapex. I don't have an electric type. So. Nature's madness it. Oh, that's a good idea, actually. But he has recover, so there's actually not a point in doing that. I'm gonna go back in a Flygon. <laughs> Got him. There we go. Unless this thing is also Scarf. Is he dual Scarf? That would be kind of irritating. I'll click Earthquake again, whatever. No, he's definitely... Oh, I knew it. I God fucking knew damn. it. damn. There's a special attack boost, but I can shift gear here with my gear now. And start doing the damage. But he still has Toxapex, and I can't touch Toxapex. Um, that was really risky on my part. I shouldn't have done that. Buzzwall kind of grabs a kill, I think. Sure, let's go into Buzzwall. Leech Life just murders his team. I could also superpower the Scissor, but I think I'd rather just Leech Life here. Uh, I mean, I feel like he's gonna go into Scissor, Salazzle, or uh, it doesn't Leech matter. Is everything. I'm, I'm banded, so like it's going to do a lot of damage to anything. There's Toxapex, let's see how much this does. There it is. Alright, so that's gonna do zero. Trash. He's gonna have a baneful bunker here, I think. You can go into McGinner, actually. Wait, does McGinner have anything for this? Like earth power it, it or just moon blood? It doesn't have okay. a earth power, unfortunately. So you might have to go into Porygon Z. I think so too. Porygon Z yeah. also sweeps this team, but like whatever. I'm just gonna hit Thunderbolt for now. Wait for Toxic, alright. Um, <clears throat> what's he gonna switch into? Most I kind of want to ice beam. Yeah, the, I want to ice beam the crook. He might protect here though. That's the thing. Oh yeah, for the baneful bunker, just to see what you're gonna do. You're not choice, right? I'm not. I'm I'm Z. So if you do a normal conversion, wouldn't you just turn into his typing? No, I would. I don't know if that's how it works. I'm pretty sure that's how conversion works. There it is. Got him. Hey, hey, hey Porygon. That's my boy. All right, so that was really, really nice for us. That means Flygon can sweep if he was still alive. Um, Scizor is here. Magirna kind of walls it. Everything it has, Scizor has, Magirna walls. I'm just going to go into Magirna. If he Swords dances here, it's going to be kind of annoying. But, oh, God, must be crit, nice. Man. Must be fuck? nice. Scizor is here. Get off a little bit of damage. That's so irritating. That's max attack though, it's good to know. You don't want to go into bus full? I kind of do. Like save save Magirna? Kind of do. But there's still nothing I could do to Toxapex. If I Doesn't matter, it's going to get the scissor out of here. But he's probably going to switch out anyways, fearing the HP fire. If he fears the HP fire, he's probably going to go into Salazzle. I kind of really want a Flash Cannon. He might go into Toxapex too. I want to double. I'm going to go into bus full, whatever. And Salazzle. That did not work out. I mean, Magirna couldn't have done anything like that either. But it's frail. I could have got off damage. Um, He's going to fire. Going to Tapu. 
I kind of want to predict him to go for a grass. Because what you said, poison. he was choice, right? I really think he's going to go for a poison type move. I think yeah. he just left. No, he didn't. That's some other view. Oh, he did. Um, Turn the timer on. <clears throat> no, he's back. All right, so I think he's going to go for a fire, a poison type move. Uh, I can superpower for like mad damage. Yep, that worked out too. Um, this is not going to work out though. That still took him down his sash. Yeah. It's resisted, but this is buzzwool. He's life orb. Oh no, he's he's sack. I'm gonna say he's life orb. So what do I sack? Um, Magirna. Kind of. And then yeah. go into mimic you and shadow sneak it. I think Magirna is a play. Damn it, I really like Magirna. I don't like sacking off my girl. I mean, but but buzzwool has the better stuff right now. Let me just shadow sneak here because there's no reason to predict. This thing actually beats his team. <laughs> Mimikyu destroys this man. Mimikyu actually. is the best, man. Mimikyu is amazing. I love Mimikyu. There it is. Let me take a little bit of life orb. That's fine. Alright. Let's see how he reacts to this. Zerk Tree is here to break our sash. We don't have an electric type resistance anymore. So I think our play is to attack this with play rough. Oh. oh no. I thought he would just click Thunderbolt just to try to sweep us right now. But I guess he didn't want to do that. That's kind of annoying. I really hope he doesn't go Scizor. Why do we lose? Glob, why? Toxapex isn't a big deal. I guess. I think we're going to lose yeah. this game, though. That's unfortunate. Everybody's running Salazzle. This is nice. Oh, that's nice. That worked out for us. Hey. <clears throat> Fuck that. Come on, come on, most. Not my come on, most. So now he just matter. goes into Zerk Tree and proceeds to click Thunderbolt a couple times. Oh, it's so irritating. I can't let him get any kills either, but as soon as, like, he just wins, I think. Click Willow here. Please don't miss Mimikyu. Oh, I forget we have speed because Mimikyu is so stupid fast for no reason. Now you just proceed to beat on it, or you can switch into Porygon. Uh, I'm going to go into Buswell. I can't set up on this because it's still neutral. I have, to, I have to set up on Toxapex. If I want to win this game, I have to set up on Toxapex. But I won't even win. No, I do because I'm faster than Zerk Tree. So but I have to let... Porygon? Uh, yeah, Porygon will be faster than Zerk Tree after a, after a Z conversion. So I have to let this thing die or let something die. And like switch non Toxapex. I don't think he's going to let that happen though. But I think double superpower can take down the Toxapex. Oh, he just lets me do that. There's my... Oh, I don't get Beast Boost. I was really hoping to get Beast Boost. All right, go into Tox Specs here. I can't let him go into Zerk Tree because then I lose. But he's going to go into Zerk Tree and win. No, <laughs> oh, why'd you do this? Kakashi. These things are so busted, man. Crap. Crap, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I think no matter what, I lose this. Oh, I. Whoa! He what happened? Switched. He both switched. Oh my god, this is amazing. This he is actually spectacular. Now, now oh, I yeah. think I have to double into Porygon. He's Scarf, so he's not going to be doing that much damage. I have 391 HP. Porygon has 311. 142 Spidef. Porygon has 186. I think we'll die. But I think I have to hard switch to Porygon and click conversion. I don't think I have a choice. We got a special tag. Got a special tag perfect, 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 perfect. We win. I think that's it. Oh my god, Porygon coming through. Oh, Porygon. Please don't so kill me. With, work? Please don't have that ability that lets, that lets you um, crit me and then like do too much damage. Don't have it. Don't have it. Don't have it. Don't have it. No! Bruh. No! He knew. No. <laughs> Fuck this. It's over. I just switched out and back in. It's over. It's over. I can't do anything. It's not like I can. I can't dude. conversion again. Oh wait a minute. No, it's not gonna matter because you'll still kill me. Damn it. That sucks. I mean, if anything, you can get rid of this. This doesn't have absorb, does it? No, it doesn't. Can mimic you survive? I think it can actually. Maybe. That was so whack. Oh man, Mimikyu. That was so whack. Like, I, I feel for you, but at the same time, I'm like... 
I'm mean, jumping for that Glee was his best that, play. That was his plus. Best that was play. a really nice play. Like I, I like Toxapex a lot. I think I have to go for play rough here. Yeah, whatever. Fuck this game. All right, we lose. Um. Yeah, it's over. Oh well. You're up. Stupid fucking Zerg tree, man. That flygon Damn. play was too it was too bad. That was a really bad play. You're up. All right, all right. So Memoswan or Skarmory is the lead. He could go with, uh, with Gengar too. Um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Memoswan. I mean, everything is it's probably gonna be Sash if it is Memoswan. So that's gonna suck because he's gonna get a hit off on something. Um, I don't think Sash Memoswan exists right now. Cause like that's lead Memos one, and there's no stealth rocks on Memos one, so. Yes, there is. And the stealth rock? Does he learn Memos stealth rock? I have a Memos one with stealth rock right now. I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna start off with Tapu. Swine up, right? This is. I don't see. Who gives it to him though? Like, is it a legal egg move? Because I know, like, just because it's an egg move doesn't mean it's legal. Yeah, let me look real quick. Oh, I'll pull it up. Let's see here. Did you make a play, or are you just waiting on him? Yeah, stealth rocks is an egg move. Um, who, though. Like, it has to be probably, a legal egg move. Probably Gigalith. Like, I didn't look. I know PK Hex is telling me it's legal. I'll just check. Uh, well, just uh, PK Hex says it's legal for all the stuff. That was an egg move. Um, let me check. Serebi, Mamo, Swine, Sun, and Moon. Because that's, hey, that's I called very, that lead, though. Nice. And I'm going to Gen 7. <clears throat> Do not see Stealth Rocks. Yeah, it can't get Stealth Rocks this gen. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Let me check right here. Details. Um, oh, he gets her from Lycan Rock. Oh, that's really cool. There you go. Uh, what the fuck do I do against this Skarmory? Oh, you, you know what? Can that, I... dude. You have Magirna. He doesn't have Iron Head. Like, you have Magirna. So what this. do I do with Magirna? Just Flare Cannon? No, it's a Steel type. You click Aura Sphere. Oh. Can I shift in his face or no? Don't do that. Uh, if you want, it's not like it's gonna get you anywhere right now. I'm gonna have to change the Magirna set though. It doesn't cover too much. Um, let's see what else Magirna gets. Does he get Earth Power? I don't think. Doesn't it does. shift your raise my speed. Yeah, it raises my yeah. speed too. That's the point of it. It's only does. That's we only have it for speed. This uh, clean up late game. Yeah, he can't touch you. Like Brave Bird is his only offensive move. So I mean, you might as well just click Aura Sphere here. Unless he's predicting you'd go for HP fire, but like unless he goes into Gengar for whatever reason, we should be okay. And Gengar can't really touch you, at least knock you out in one hit, because Magirna always survives a hit. Nice. All right, so I'm gonna put down my notes of stuff that are important to know. Mammoth Swine is a stealth rocker. Competitive notes. Excuse me. SR Mammo. This man is taking his sweet time right now. Why'd you shift gear? I told you not to shift gear. He can whirlwind, dude. It's a Skarmory. That's what they do. Mm. That's why I told you just to attack it. I'll click Aura Sphere, I guess. Not really much we can do now. Hopefully he doesn't whirlwind you into anything horrible. That did so much. I did nothing. Uh, it's a Skarmory. It's a Spadef Skarmory to be specific. I uh, just click Superpower here. There we go. I like that. I like that a lot. Yep. You can tell it was Spadef because he took so little from Surf. That's why I knew Superpower would kill. <laughs> That's that Obviously, Blizz thought 35% was nothing to Skarmory, even though it's Spadef that did so much damage. Blizz still has a lot to learn. You're right. But we got our Beast Boost back, and he has to go into Gengar. Like, he doesn't really have a play. Because <laughs> even, even Clefable is going to be taking an ass ton from Superpower. There it is. Gengar! And this thing's going to click 
Probably Shadow Ball. He might go for like Never Ending Nightmare. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, the um, Z move. move. He might go for Willow too. Uh, I think Porygon. So Porygon? Okay. I think so. Because we don't really need it this game. It's not going to win us the game. I mean, it can, but like it's not necessary to win us the game. Ooh. And we can just Willow. click the shadowiest of balls here. Unless you want to predict his focus and like go into Mimic You. I definitely want to defog with Tapu though. Oh, so God just damn. Kills. I keep underestimating this Pokemon. Um, okay, he doesn't have Levitate anymore. So what's he got? Willow, Sludge Bomb, most likely Shadow Ball. I don't want to be burned though. That's the thing. Why are you, why are you questioning this? Just going to Mimic you. Click, click Shadow Sneak. <laughs> it's your only player right now. Oh, you're right. Yeah. You want to predict him and go for Play Rough. That's a play. But like, you might as well just go for Shadow Sneak. It's safe. This man is this man is taking his sweet sweet time. My man how, doesn't want to. How are we gonna? He doesn't want to lose. I think Magirno wins us this game now. This Garmory's dead. Like actually, like if we can kill off, we can kill off uh, Gengar or weaken it enough, we can shift gear with Magirno and win. Probably shift gear on uh, Clefable or Galissapod because Galissapod can't do much to us. We resist everything but its Aqua Jet unless it goes for Liquefaction. But you revealed the shift gear way too early, so he's probably going to attack us every time. So I don't think that's going to be our way of winning either. See, I wasn't thinking about like the reveals making um making things happen. I didn't think about it that way. Yeah. That's nice to like look into, or like I guess understand. Yeah, uh, we can win with Flygon then against Galissapod again. Hopefully, uh, he doesn't crit us, and we have to knock out Mammoth Swine first though to do that. So Ice Shard doesn't win. Uh, Bus will always chips things down. Tapu is going to be a good wall. I want to defog as soon as we can. Nice. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> Curse body Gengar. Totally coming right. through there. <laughs> is he orbed? Yes. Thank you. He is orbed. Yeah, we already knew he was orbed. Um, but now we win with Magirna, kind of, if we can set up successfully. But I want to defog first so we take as little damage as possible. We have Feeny to we, we have Feeny actually to wall Mammoth Swine to an extent and Clefable to an extent. And we have Feeny to stop any paralysis. So we have to put out Feeny before we set up with any of our Pokemon. Just so Clefable doesn't T-wave us. There's Mammoth Swine. Um So do we want to just burn this or no? Unless he's scarfed, we outspeed this. Uh so I burn don't it. see a reason to not burn it, I guess. If he's scarfed, that gives us an easier time to set up with Flygon. Oh, he's on Scarf. Perfect. All right, that's actually really nice. That makes setting up with Flygon way easier. Hard switch to um, Feeny, so we can get off a of Defog and scare this thing out. All that damage. It's too much damage, bro. 17. <laughs> Defoginators. It is time. Defog. I can't believe this thing got Defog. I'm so happy. Like, it's about time we have good Pokemon like this that have Defog. I'm sick of running the same, like, five Defog Pokemon. So, he might get into a Stealth Rock War with us. So, he gonna surf it? I mean, if you surf it, we can't Defog again. Oh, so That's what do thing. you want to... I mean, you you, really it's, 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 it's your play either. Either Defog again or you surf right now. I don't know. I don't know how he thinks. All right, that works out in the end. Um... First impression is not going to happen because we resist it. He's not going to Sucker Punch. Aqua Jet. I don't know what his last attack is and what he's trying to do with this. <laughs> I really don't know what he wants to do. Unless he's setting up spikes here. But he has Skarmory for spikes. What's he going to... I don't know. What's he going to do? Everything he is, does I've is I've never resistant. seen a Galissapod the size and story and not kill it every time. I know first, first impression is really powerful, but... Yeah, but we resist it because we're a fairy type. So what do we do? I kind of want to just go hard into Magirna and see what he does. He went for Poison Jump. Oh, Shift Gear. Shift Gear, it's time. It's time we win. GG. <laughs> and there's no uh, Toxapex anymore. <laughs> I don't know if we win, but we definitely get off a lot of damage. Because if we kill something, our Flare Heart will, uh, will only be at minus one. Which mm -hmm. is not bad at all, I guess. If he switches out here, we get an easy kill on anything else. Yep, there's the Mammoth Swine. Now we get off an Aura Sphere kill. 
Hey, and he's burned, so he finish. can't knock us out. And then we get our plus one, and then we kill everything after that. And then we I get like back. I love McGirna, dude. Soul Heart is so good. Because if he were to die from burn, if he were if he were to die from burn, McGirna would still get the Soul Heart ability. Because it doesn't matter if you directly kill it. Give me that plus one. Ah, ah. <laughs> give me that plus one. It's over. There we go. This is all I wanted from this team. I wanted McGirna sweep. This is all I wanted from this team. All right, what you gonna do? There's an X button right there. I would recommend playing, clicking it. Flash cannon this hoe. What does he think he's doing? <laughs> Get out of here. Well, Get oh, yeah, out of here. Oh yeah, doesn't matter anymore. Huh? I said I don't doesn't matter anymore. It does matter. Oh, that so that thing wasn't true. Yeah. Did he quit? Yeah, he had to. He lost. Fucking bitch. <laughs> I just wanted to see the sweep. All right, guys. Why well, do people take that from me. <laughs> it's been thirty minutes. Of, it's been thirty minutes. I'm gonna end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to drop a like, subscribe, share all the good jazz. I'm gonna try to do Wi-Fi battles with the team and then like do a showdown live with it afterwards. Uh, that's gonna be the relative plan. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like, subscribe, share all the good jazz. Go check out my boy Blizz, and I will see you guys later. Peace. Later.